Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another Man 21 Ultimate Team video, and today I ended up finishing the challenges to earn yourself the 90 overall Natmosphere player, and I also had 700 treats, so I went ahead and bought this 87 overall Atmosphere Fantasy Pack. I just earned all those treats completely free, so I was like, hey, I might as well get that, but we have our 90 overall Natmosphere Fantasy Pack. I'm super excited. We got to go ahead and choose our player of choice. Now, obviously, I do need to add Raheem Mostert to the theme team, but also, I could go with either Quentin Nelson or DJ Reader to go ahead and complete the set. But I think the smarter thing to do would just to be go with Raheem Most right here. Because he's like 300k right now. And being able to get him for cheap would be a pretty good thing. But there is one thing I want to look into. Because um, with the whole uh, new sets thing, there's a few different ways you can go ahead and complete sets for easy, easily cheap. But another thing that came in super duper clutch is in an 83 to 87 overall, um, pack from the challenges, we pulled an 87 Andy Janovich, so we just got him completely free to add him to the set, so that's super clutch. Now, like I said, um... I want to go ahead and uh, get to Jim Brown, but I know there are ways to go ahead and complete, because I believe Terry McLaurin is a more expensive card. Now, if we look into these prices, um, this card, Raheem Mostert, it's about 265k, so I'm going to kind of just have a calculator open, and I want to do some math real quick. Uh, so, about 265k for um, Raheem Mostert, and then we also have a 270 for Jair Alexander. So, that's about 535k, and then we got the 87 right here, which is about 80k, and then we also have the 85, which is probably about 35k, I'd have to guess, 32k, probably 35k is probably a solid, solid, uh, consistent filter, so it'd be about 650k to complete the set, now I know I cannot obviously do that, but I know there are probably coin making methods with this, so if we look, I want to look into the um, price of Terry McLaurin and his power up, I don't know uh, if he had a power up previous to this set coming out, I'm not exactly sure, so we'll have to see if he did, um, as you guys can see I was looking at Jim Brown's price, but um, looking at Terry McLaurin right here, Terry uh, Mc... Uh, I wonder if there's two C's or not. Uh, no, there's not. So his power-up is like 65k, and then his other card's like 501k. So, looking at this, it looks like it'd be about 560k if he sold it, which would be about 510k after tax. So, you'd have about 100, you'd be down about 150,000 coins, but you have two nat, um, of those 90 overall players. Like, that's a really good price to get both those players, because both of them are like what like 400k 500k in total which is a crazy amount so you're getting them both for 150 150k which obviously a great way to just get those two players if you need them um but what i'm really trying to look into is if there's a way to make coins because with the previous set at the beginning you could get you could um, sell everything off except for one of the 90s and you'd have and you make your coins back and you just keep one of the 90s but um i believe those 90s quick sell for uh 275 because they normally here i could pull up the spreadsheet that i have um normally those cards the 90 sell for 1500 i believe it was um three was it 325 it might have been 325 no 375 i believe that is what it is i believe you get a i believe you get 750 treats from that and with those 750 treats you could obviously go ahead and open up a 87 overall most feared fantasy pack so you could just add about 80k to that so if you were to so you could pretty much just get like a raheem moser for like 70k that's honestly a really really solid price if you were to do that but like i said you need to have a lot of coins you need to have 650k to go ahead and get this raheem moser for 70k there's an easy coin making not a coin making method but an easy way to get cheap players on your te team if you guys want you get a solid jair alexander you get a really solid raheem moser card but after looking into that, I'm probably just going to go ahead and end up taking Mostert out this thing. Um, just because I'm going to probably get one of these guys. Uh, well, I want to see. Is the house rules? Um, is it a fantasy pack you run from the house rules? No, if it is, then I'm pretty sure it's a fantasy pack. But I just want to double check. Um, yeah, hero fantasy. So you get to choose. Um, so I'll probably just either go DJ Reader or Quentin Nelson in there and buy the other one. Or just kind of grind for it. Grind some easy trades. 
but um i think what i'm gonna go ahead and do i think i think i'm gonna go ahead and buy this raheem not buy this get this raheem most right here and then also i have this 87 overall most weird fantasy pack so i can go ahead and select um either leonard Fournette or justin reed i'm gonna go justin reed and i'm gonna sell him on the auction block get some extra coins and we'll be able to possibly um power up this raheem mostert so i'll be back with you guys once i have enough training and we're gonna look into powering up raheem mostert oh and one thing you probably noticed that my training just went up i realized that um i forgot this morning i had my twist drops pack which they made like prime gaming now is what it's called and like i pulled an 88 aaron donald out of it it was a nat pack it was like since they just switched over to like prime gaming instead of twitch prime um it's now and called an it's called prime gaming so i just received like a, a pack and it contained one core elite and i pulled aaron donald uh he was not anyway i wasn't gonna throw him in any, any sets because you can't so i just ended up quick selling we got like 1200 training for him um definitely that's definitely solid we're gonna go ahead and throw this justin reed up for 80k uh we'll be able to get 72k from that which is solid solid stuff right there but what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're just gonna look for uh raheem mustard right here and we'll throw him in the power up set i doubt 2000 training is enough to go ahead and power him up all the way but we'll have to see we got raheem mostert right here as uh as, whoa words justin reed just sold as it looks like we might have enough and no we're gonna be like 200 training short which kind of sucks um i'm gonna look at my binder see if i have maybe 200 training sitting around do i have 200 training sitting around i doubt that um i got rashawn gary but he's quick sells for treats uh, I don't have any training sitting around, so I'm going to go ahead and go buy 200 training real quick, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so we honestly kind of got a snipe. I got this Christian Kirksey ultimate kickoff card for about 5K. It's not the best training value, but I didn't feel like buying a ton of training anyway. So we are just going to go ahead and get that, and now we have enough to go ahead and get um, Raheem Mostert up to a 90 overall. This is my fourth. 90 overall halfback and then jim brown is going to be my fifth like these browns and panthers just have too many good halfbacks and then we also have mike davis who's an 88 we have insane halfbacks on these theme teams uh so we'll go ahead and throw in raheem mostert into the power up set we got a 91 overall raheem mostert for completely free um if i refund this will i have enough um i'll get 27 training back will i have enough uh i believe i have exactly enough oh my god that is clutch uh, exactly enough training to go and get go deep times two on this man front art wise uh, that looks sick right there I might honestly have to go with that uh, scary fast Raheem Mostert all the way why isn't it showing you yeah all the way powered up there we go uh, I wish it showed like a little bit of power art, power card art in there but power up card art is what I meant to say but that's super sick Raheem Mostert he also gets backfield master evasive he gets jukebox not the best abilities in the world i know backfield master is really really good uh but other than that raheem mostert is a really really solid card i'm excited to have this man on the team we'll go ahead and add him to the browns theme team and we'll see what he is gonna be looking like on the team i believe he's my best halfback because cream hunt is only a 90 powered up uh so i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and just go back in the binder and promote him to starter so i don't have to move a ton of stuff around on my offense i don't really feel like moving a ton of cards around so we'll just go ahead and i forgot uh raheem Mostert's power up is the newest he's just gonna be at the top near my top overalls anyway so we'll just go ahead and add him to the browns theme team now like i said expect a browns theme team update super soon with me getting jim brown uh Come pretty soon i'm probably gonna be getting jim brown so expect a browns team team update uh pretty dang soon but raheem mostert on the main team is a 92 now i want to check him out on the browns team team see if he's up to a 93 maybe um it'd be insane if he was up to a 93 this card is really really good though like with that speed oh my this card is going to be deadly on the browns team team i cannot imagine how good he is going to be uh i believe he's already in the browns team team as the number three halfback so uh he is up to a 92 on the browns team team but i want to go ahead and promote him to starter not compare i want to promote him to starter uh we'll go ahead and see what his stats are once he is the starting halfback looking at his sets he's got 95 speed oh my god 94 excel 90 agility 91 carry 90 change of direction 86 break tackle 91 juke oh my god this card looks insanely good wow 83 kick return as well 95 speed on this card is insane bro oh man i'm excited to add raheem most to the team he is a really really good running back he's my technically fifth best card on the team but he's tied with like guys like denzel ward and stuff but oh my this 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 raheem Mostert card is unbelievably good i'm super excited to add him to the team 
but yeah guys i think that is gonna be the video we did a bunch of stuff i oh i showed you guys my free 90 overall nat uh card from the challenges now expect a video later today going over the nat uh for the house rules and um i'll probably be doing gameplay right after this video with the raheem mostert and house rules so expect that uh wait oh i can't use mostert and house rules i don't i can't i don't believe that crap i forgot about that so i'd have to get some normal gameplay with him which kind of sucks but we expect raheem mostert gameplay expect jim brown gameplay expect brown's theme team gameplay as soon as i can get that out expect a video tonight going over the house rules rewards because i'm getting that done tonight i already have 10 wins i just need 15 more and um in that video i might have castled jagenstein done as well so i'm doing a bunch of grinding but yeah guys that is gonna be the video hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did make sure to drop a like down below and subscribe to Nodi Zombie. i'll see you boys in the next one peace out